I thank you, Hillary. Well, for most of us, it's just instinct to run away from a fire. However, two young local men did the exact opposite to help an elderly woman in need when her home caught fire on New Year's Eve. WSBT 22's Cassidy Williams joining us now live in the studio with the story. Cassidy. Gloria and Helena Hattery say they had no idea their Lakeville area home was on fire until they looked out the window and saw two young men they had never seen before ready to lend a hand. Cameron Dalrymple of Lakeville probably never expected to see a sight like this on New Year's Eve. He and his friend were on their way to hang out and watch movies in the 23,000 block of New Road when they noticed smoke pouring from the house next door. 87-year-old Gloria Hattery and her daughter were inside, unaware of the fire. And then the next thing, the dog was going nuts and I went to the picture window and there's my neighbor and two guys that I'd never seen before. It soon became clear the fire was spreading. Gloria, who uses a wheelchair, needed to get out. I tried to take the wheelchair and, and make it move, and um, it got stuck. So then he just grabbed her, and he just took her out. Cameron Dalrymple was the man who took action to get Gloria to safety as they waited for the fire trucks to arrive. I, I said to him, are you sure you can manage me? And he said yes, and zoom, that was it. Cameron says he would do it all again and only wishes he would have had more time to save the pets inside. And I knew that had we not probably been there, it could have been a lot worse. The Hatteries are now rebuilding with the help of the Lakeville community. They say the kindness shown to them by Cameron and others has been incredible. I mean, as horrible and as horrible as that was, the, the outpouring of love and support and, and kindness that we've gotten has just been, you know, overwhelming. There are a lot of good people in this world that are ready to pitch in to take their own life, I guess, in hand and help other people. Cameron says he hopes others would make a similar choice. Take action before it's too late because if I would have, if we would have second guessed ourselves, it might have been too late. The Hattery's loss includes their home, their vehicle, and their pets. Despite the loss, they are still trying to look at this as a fresh start. And with the community's help, they feel confident they will be able to move forward.